welcome. Well, Enjoy I'm your so evening. I'm so glad to be here. Thank you. Yeah. Our first case study was Who Am I? A study of getting to know you. We told stories about ourselves and listened to our fellow crew members' stories. located on the continent of Asia. Let me share my learning with you. We're in our celebration of learning right now, which is a culmination of our learning expeditions that our kids have been doing. So tonight is about kids presenting their learning, their learning processes to community members, to parents, to, to really any visitor that wants to come. The cows brought the kettles and they used this to steer the cows. What was your favorite thing about Kenya? Probably the shields because they chase off the lions with it. This was our first celebration of learning, a big part of expeditionary learning where students present to an authentic audience. Here is what I learned, not just here's my poem or here's my hero's journey paper, but it's here's the journey I went through. Here's what my learning looked like and felt like, and here's how I'm forever changed because I did that. Is that a picture of them at school? Yeah, that's a picture of them meditating. Oh, they meditate at school? Yeah, and this is my prop, because Peruvians love to play soccer. It's incredible to see how my kids have grown uh, over the year. My daughter has spoken in public for the first time to strangers, and my son is, you know, showing everything he's learned about Ethiopians and other kids around the world. a landscape called Machu Picchu. The Red Indians build this landscape. They have bicycle libraries. They have these big baskets that carry books. So I show perseverance because my self-portrait, it took me a long time, you know? The first time that I ever stood up in front of people was when I was in high school. And here I'm seeing my first grader and my third grader with so much confidence standing up and talking to adults and strangers. And I think in terms of applying that to the real world, that is such an amazing skill. I really came in here thinking that I was gonna have a hard time revising my own work, have a hard time making my own improvements. I look to peers and I look to teachers to really help me understand and really help me go through these stages in my own life and really put it all into my story. So many things that from this learning experience that they were able to walk away with and that they will always remember, just things such as being able to collaborate with peers, working on the writing process, being able to synthesize their thinking. So how the hero's journey connects to everyday life, we thought it was challenges because in our story, a hero has to face surgery, which is a huge challenge, and then in everyday life, you have to face challenges and just overall how incredibly impressed I was by this group of students and how they were able to articulate the depth of their thinking. Having an event that celebrates academics, celebrates learning, is huge. And it, it brings the importance of learning forward. It also brings purposeful audience to kids. The real ones are made out of clay and are much bigger. They take them to a body of water, fill them up, and since they're so heavy when they're full, they carry them back on their heads. 